Our other top story tonight, San Diego County officially moves into the red tier tomorrow. That means indoor operations at restaurants, gyms and movie theaters can resume, but there will still be restrictions when it comes to capacity. And while many business owners are celebrating, others are questioning why they are still shut down. News 8's Richard Allen takes a closer look at the new red tier rules as well as what it will take to make it to the even less restrictive orange tier. Richard. Well, that's right. Entering the red tier now gives the green light for restaurants to reopen to indoor service capped at 25%. We've been planning for this for weeks and weeks. Restaurants like Solare at Liberty Station. And we just want to make sure all the tables are correctly distanced, that we're following all the safety protocols. Under the red tier, movie theaters can reopen now at 25% capacity. Retail businesses and shopping centers can increase capacity from 25 to 50%. And places of worship can allow congregants inside at 25% capacity. Gyms and fitness centers will also be able to welcome guests inside at 10%. 24 Hour Fitness is extremely excited to be able to reopen for all of our members here in the San Diego market. But not all business owners throughout the county are as excited. I'm really just sitting tight and I'm just trying to remain as hopeful as possible. Julie Casmi is owner of the Silver Fox in Pacific Beach, a family owned bar which would have celebrated its 45th anniversary last summer. Instead, it's been shut down for the past year with a brief one week reopening last June. While bars can reopen for outdoor service under the orange tier, because because the Silver Fox has only indoor seating, Julie must wait until San Diego reaches the yellow tier, although she believes she could safely reopen to customers now. 100% I feel singled out. I feel I feel like the, uh, what is it, the evil redheaded stepchild. <laughs> Hope is on the horizon, though. While San Diego just officially reached the red tier, there are signs we could be closing in on orange. The testing positivity is 2.8%, which is the orange tier. San Diego's case rate per 100,000, now at 6.8, would also have to fall below 4 for two straight weeks to enter orange. Julie says she is staying positive. I'm not going down like this. I'm... I am determined to get that place up and going again. And health officials are cautioning San Diegans to continue preventive measures like mask wearing and social distancing to, of course, avoid sliding back into the purple tier.